Hi everyone, I hope you're all doing really well and honestly I'm so excited to film today's video. As you can see from the title, I'm going to show you some of my most favourite pieces ever and they're all second hand. <laughs> So before we get into the video, if you could please like and subscribe, honestly, it takes no time at all, but it means the world to me. So I actually grew up wearing secondhand pieces just because that was the situation me and my family was at the time. Since then, our situation has changed massively. I still go back to car boots and charity shops and I love it. I must admit, I'm a bargain hunter. Car boots are like the biggest thing I'm missing during this lockdown. Me and my mum keep saying we can't wait for car boots to open because honestly, it's turned into a little hobby now. <laughs> so the first item that I'm going to show you are these Levi shorts. I must have picked these up, I want to say three or four. It was before university. So it must be four or five years ago. So these I've had for years now but they still look like new. The quality is just amazing because obviously it's Levi's. So yeah, this is what they look like. If you own any Levi jeans, any Levi shorts, then you know how amazing the quality is, but also how expensive they can be. Now, guess how much I paid for these shorts? Two pounds. Now, if that's not a bargain, then I don't know what is. <laughs> These are literally such a staple. You can dress them up, you can dress them down. So I'm so glad I found them at the car boot. So following on from the shorts, this item is also one of my summer favourites. And it's this beautiful, beautiful crochet bikini. This is from H&M. And once again, I found this at the car boot. And I'm pretty sure I only paid a pound for this, which... I can imagine it was a lot more expensive in H&M. So as you can see, it's this really nice crochet detailing and also it's double lined at the back, which makes it really nice and secure. This is what the bottoms look like. So once again, they're double lined and they're a really nice shape at the back. So I don't really want to try on the bikini right now. So I'll just insert a little clip from my last summer holiday, which is making me a little bit sad because I wish I was on holiday right now. <laughs> This next item was such a find. I'm pretty sure I found it eight years ago because I was still in high school. I found it in Poland in a second-hand shop and I'm pretty sure the owner didn't realise the brand because it's this Moschino top. And I hope I'm pronouncing that right. I don't really want to embarrass myself. <laughs> but it really is just a black sleeveless top. It is the softest thing I've ever felt, even after having it for so many years. It really is such a simple top, so you can wear it so many ways. You can dress it up, you can dress it down and wear it with joggers, leggings. Honestly, I have got so much wear out of this top. I remember the price being really, really cheap to the point where I was like, okay, I need to run to the till and buy this straight away before anyone finds it or before anyone realises that this is a designer piece. So yeah, I remember just being so over the moon with this. As soon as I found it on the rack, I was like, okay, this is mine. So the next item, I feel like everyone has their favourite accessory, whether that's some earrings, a headband, sunglasses, whatever it may be. Mine is a belt. <laughs> so this is what the belt looks like. It's just a leopard print belt. If my jeans or shorts have loops, then this is the belt that I'm going for. I found this belt in an American thrift shop and it was a small, small town next to Hancock in New York where I was a camp counsellor two summers ago, I believe. And I picked up quite a few pieces from there, but this is by far my favourite. So when I first bought the belt, it was in such good condition. Since then, I've worn it a lot. So it has cracked a little bit on the other side, but obviously you can't really see that. But I just love the fact that this leopard print is furry. <sighs> Anything leopard print I love, but this belt is just my absolute favourite. So my camera just died, but I was saying that I don't know the exact price of this belt. Just because the thrift shop where I bought this from actually had an offer on that day. And I'm pretty sure it was something between five to ten dollars for a plastic bag full of clothes accessories whatever you decide to put in there so this worked out really cheap 
So the next item is this beautiful faux fur coat. I'm so happy I found this because at the time I was actually looking to buy a fur coat like this myself and this coat was actually mentioned in my car boot haul so if you want to watch that then I will make sure to have it linked just up there and in the description down below. So I remember the woman that was selling this coat, it was at a car boot and she had another coat exactly the same, the same brand except it was a lot lighter so it was like a lighter fur but I just fell in love with this one, this chocolate colour, so beautiful, so soft. So I only bought this last summer and I only paid £2 for this coat which I think it's so amazing and it's such a bargain. I've worn this to Kieran's graduation, to the races. I'm so glad that I found this because a coat like this is usually so expensive, especially when you want the quality to be as good as this one. So honestly, I'm so grateful. <laughs> so that's all that I have to show you today. Let me know in the comments which item was your favourite. And yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye! Oh,